Now we come to another important area where the small intestine converts over to the large intestine. And the ileocecum valve is a valve that opens and closes to allow that to happen. Sometimes it gets stuck shut. Sometimes it gets stuck open. The proper functioning requires good parasympathetic innervation, innervation that comes from being more relaxed, being more well rested. It's common that people have difficulty at that ileocecum valve. When we come to the ASIS, we can come out perpendicular about two fingers to three fingers. And right there we have the ileocecum valve. We can press in, and this is a similar idea to the gallbladder treatment. When we press in, and we press up toward the left shoulder. Press in, and hold, wait. Release, and we can do that two or three times. Press in. You might find the second time or third time you can go in a little deeper. Press in, but also upward. You could also do an easy massage motion. Moving circular. Sometimes you can move circular and massage and then add the vibrating. Smooth passage from the small intestine through to the large intestine is essential. The absorption has taken place in the small intestine and now all the waste products are being shifted over to the large intestine to be processed for elimination. 